Jayaratnam would not remain in Parliament for long. In 1986, he was prosecuted over a false declaration of accounts by his Workers' Party. He was fined and sentenced to a month in Queenstown Prison. The prison officers were embarrassed. They knew about me, but I didn't get any preferential treatment. It was grim. As a convicted criminal, Joe Rutnam had to give up his seat in Parliament. But Singapore was a Commonwealth country, and the last Court of Appeal was still in London. With the law law, of the Privy Council. In 1988, they heard Jay Rutland's case and overturned the conviction, describing it as a grievous injustice. I came back and asked the president to remove my convictions. And what was his reply? You have shown no remorse, no penitence. I hadn't admitted that I had committed offences, and though I can't be pardoned. Privy Council said I had not done anything wrong. Eventually, Joe Rutnam did return briefly to Parliament, but his career was dogged by a series of complex lawsuits brought against him by the leaders of the PAP. 